what is going on everybody welcome 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 to a game called dr smiley's funhouse and those rainbow clouds the music is popping i never trust a doctor named smiley and and it's it probably might go wrong i don't know i don't know what this game is about there's a help about about preferences load and start. I don't know why I had to say that. I feel like y'all needed to know for some reason. But let's just get started. We, no, let, hold back, hold back. Before we go in, follow me on Twitch, subscribe on YouTube, and that's all I have to say. Let's start. Warning. Oh my God. Is this a horror game? This is not a light hearted game um despite the art style some content may be triggered triggering to some viewers oh i hope it's not that bad y'all been warned do you wish to continue yes i understand the given warnings your name is adrian michael Right? I say that right? I think I did. I'm not good at reading names. You've never been a very happy kid. Oh, is this about depression? Okay, I get it now. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Bullied at school. I hope I hope y'all not getting bullied. Unloved at home? Come on, man. You have nowhere to go. So now you're going where the rest of the bad kids go. You still remember the day she took you there. It was storming. Fitting weather considering the dr dreadful nature of the day. Oh, is this me? Of course it is. We just seen ourselves. While you personally never knew anyone who had been sent to this place, you were no, no, no stranger to the various adverts. Supposedly, it's the best place for the naughtiest of children. What what they been doing if they're the... <laughs> okay, stop. If they're the, the naughtiest. You scoffed to yourself. What a joke. Do I really have to go, mom? Yes. Yes. Uh, presser? What does that mean? Stay quiet. She looks mad. I'll stay quiet. You decide to stay quiet. Just, just shut your mouth. <laughs> the rest of the car ride is spent in intense silence. Intense silence. We are here. Oh boy. Dr. Smiley's fun house. More like torture house. Psychopath. Maybe. Psychopath house. Fun house. God. The inside of this place is even worse. Let's see what's in the background. Staff only. Just be happy. It's like we happy few for some reason. I'm getting a we happy few vibes of this game. 
Well, looks like nobody's here. Guess we should go. Not so fast, bitch. <laughs> I just had to add that. She points to a small service bell on the counter. Now, she, now we wait. It takes a moment, but you hear the shuffling behind the door that's labeled staff only. I do not like that smile. It makes sense, but I do not like that smile. What's wrong with your eyebrows? What's wrong with your eyes? Everything. Hello there. You must be Adrian. Um. Hi. And you must be Mrs. Michelle, right? Or is it Michael? Michelle? I think it's Michelle. <laughs> I don't know. It's a pleasure to meet you. Finally. You're my only visitors. <laughs> yes, of course, Dr. Smiley. They shake hands and you scrouch. Scrouch. <laughs> your neck, your nose. What kind of name is Dr. Smiley? And they are all packed and ready? Yes, everything's there. I made sure to double check. They didn't bring anything they weren't supposed to. Good, good. Well, you be, you best say your goodbyes. Your room is waiting for torture. You sent your mom and one last plea, pleading look. She just shakes her head. You be, you better make this worth my money. I can do whatever I want with your money. <laughs> I'm gonna waste more money. You know what? Talk back. As if I'm even gonna try. Yeah. Fine. Hopefully, when I come back to get you, you'll be less of a brat. She meant to say bitch. <laughs> she bits. She spits the last word hatefully, then turns and leaves without saying anything else. My oh my, someone has quite the attitude. Put that finger away. Well, have to get started on that little problem ASAP. But for now, I'll show you to your room. He begins to, he begins leading you to the door in the middle of the lobby. Uh, the one you're presuming leads to your, your room. You, I don't know what that word is. You blah 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 follow carrying your bag. Oh what a small hallway. Like I am getting claustrophobic. Is that the word? <laughs> now some important things to know. Curfew is that at is at nine. Your car outside your room with the exception of needing the restroom or emergencies. There will be consequences. You don't like how he just said consequences. Okay. In addition to curfew, you're not allowed back in the lobby unless personally escorted by me because I'm the only one who works here. You look at him confused as if you ask why. Too many instances of children trying to escape. I wonder why. You'll be surprised how many silly kids have tried to run away when I wasn't looking because it's an asylum <laughs> oh I see or something that makes you feel a bit n nervous well we're here make yourself at home bitch <laughs> and don't forget your curfew young man be, be snarky resign yourself to your fate you just look at him awkwardly and nod try not to look too sad he ushers you into your room, then leaves. My room looks cool. <laughs> it has no colors except for the sun and this word smile. The room is nothing like the lobby. It's sterile, colorless, and dreary. Dreary. I don't know. White sheets, white furniture, white walls, white everything. God, it's like a hospital in here. You decide to look around a little bit. Play it, ignore it. 
play it. You hesitantly put in the v VHS tape. No signal. This is from PSA from Dr. Smiley. Hello there. Want to click? You're probably wondering why you're exactly you're here. Why you're okay? I'm reading so bad. Well, let me clue you in. Oh gosh, you're a bad kid. You're a I don't know what that word is. No good trouble to make it. And I'm here to change that. You'll be entering my program for the worst of the worst. And by the time you're done here, question mark, your parents' frowns will be turned upside down. Well, you better get a good night rest. You have a long day ahead of you tomorrow, bitch. What the hell was that? What kind of place did your mom just sent you to? Well, best not to think about it too much. It looks like it's getting late. You should probably go to bed soon. Or you could just stay up and read. Out of your bag, you pull one of the books you brought with you. There's a no, there, there's a no phone allowed policy, and you have to entertain yourself somehow. After all, you look down at the cover. It's about sports. Somehow, it keeps you a little bit happy, and he's how I don't know how to say that word. You start losing yourself in the book, staying up long past the, the curfew. You feel yourself getting a little sleepy, and you start thinking about calling it a night. Why is everything spinning? You stand up to gather yourself, but find you're, you're too wobbly on your feet, and you pummeled, pump it to the floor. Okay, that was a hard pulp to the floor, okay? Everything is spinning and blurry, and you feel like you're floating, floating on air. Before you let the darkness overcome you, you notice one thing. You could have sworn the air smelled faintly sweet. Oh boy, what does that mean? You're just on the edge of the waking world. Everything is still fuzzy. Something is urging you to come to, though. Maybe it's that annoying sound in your ears. Or maybe it's the overwhelming feeling that something is very, very wrong. Oh sh- That scared me! Well, well, well! You could finally decide to wake up! It's about time, sleepyhead. Finally, everything is clear, and you try to sit up. But you can't. Oh my. What are we playing? What, what is this doctor trying to do to me? You're probably wondering what's going on. Well, let me explain. You're a bad kid, Adrian. It's clear from what your mother told me. You're headed down a bad, bad path, and it's my job to stop that. So let me show you what you're in for if you don't shape up your act. He's getting the tools. He's getting the toys. Oh my. You surely don't want this, right? You aggressively shake your head. Then, it seems you better get your act together. Now that you know what you're in for, I think it's time you go back to sleep. You struggle against your restraints, not trusting him, but he puts a mask around your, around your face regardless. 
It doesn't take long before a sweet smell hits your nostrils. You try to continue struggling, but now you feel a million miles away again. You give in to the exaction. You eat good end. He just what? Ooh, feed me. Good end. I didn't get the bad end. I don't know if I have another. T I don't know if I have. I have enough space for another one. I'm just gonna like say this. The end. The outro. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, follow me on Twitch. Subscribe on YouTube. And uh, this game. Oh hell no! I I know why he gave me the warning now. I can see why. But uh, yeah. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I said that again. And I'll see you guys in the next video.